Good afternoon, I'm Ren Wadsworth and this is your non-stop local news update. The city of Bozeman is celebrating Memorial Day in a big way. To date, the 14th annual Memorial Day Parade will march down Main Street and it all kicked off at 9.30 this morning. And Main Street from 11th Avenue to Wallace will remain closed to date for the duration of the parade. The parade is hosted by the American Legion Post 14, and while it is certainly not the only event put on by them, it is one of the biggest. Len Albright, the American Legion Post 14 commander, says there's going to be 55 organizations attending the parade today. There's a lot of veteran organizations you can expect to see, like the VFW, Vietnam Veterans of America, Marine Corps League, and other American Legion posts as well. You can also expect to see local groups like the Fire Department and HRDC in the parade today as well. And they're all marching to honor the lives American soldiers laid down in defense of our country. Well, Memorial Day to me is remembering and honoring all of those that have fallen before us in all wars and all conflicts of the United States of America. Uh, they're the ones that uh, gave it all and uh, for our, our freedoms and our um, way of life here. Every year, the Memorial Day Parade honors Gold Star families, and today, 61 Gold Star families will be walking in the parade or riding in military vehicles. For clarification, Gold Star families are those that have lost a loved one in combat, so we use today to honor them for their sacrifices. The parade has already started and is going on right now, but they plan to have a service at Sunset Hill Cemetery immediately after the parade, starting around noon. More information can be found online at nonstoplocal.com. And since it's Memorial Day, you may have plans to get out and enjoy nature. And we're talking about camping in the Treasure State. And Gallatin Valley's largest RV and boat show is spending its last day today in Bozeman. The event has been called the largest boat and RV show in the state of Montana. And well, this is a statewide business with lots of, and of service shops throughout the whole state. Brad Elkins, one of the outfitters, says Brett's is a family-owned business with shops, again, throughout the whole state. But this is the location that's going to have the better prices than what you're going to find in a lot of their stores. We're here to move um, inventory, especially if that inventory is a, a 2022 year model. Um, we're looking, looking to, to really blow the prices out on those guys and then get them out the door. Um, so we're really, really uh, eager to, to, to make a deal. Elkins says Brett's partners with a lot of local financers in Montana, and their goal is to help make the purchase process a stress fee as stress-free as possible. Today is the last day they're in town, so if you have camping trips planned and you've been thinking about investing in a new boat or RV, today may be the day. It's held today at the Gallatin County Fairgrounds from now until 5 tonight. Well, that's all for now, but we'll have more news updates for you as the day goes on, so make sure to check back in for more. I'm Ren Wadsworth. Thanks for tuning in to your nonstop local news.